Chung Mong-gu, the chairman of Hyundai Motor Group, will become the first South Korean ever inducted into the U.S. Automotive Hall of Fame. The U.S. Automotive Hall of Fame was established in 1939 and has honored nearly 800 business leaders from around the world. For the first time in South Korea's automotive history, Chung was now standing shoulder to shoulder next to the founder of the Ford Motor Company, Henry Ford, the inventor Thomas Edison, and the founder of Benz, Carl Benz. Chung had led South Korea's largest automaker, Hyundai Motor Group, from 2003 and rapidly expanded the company to be able to compete with the world's leading car makers. As the son of the Hyundai Group founder, Chung led Hyundai Motors and its merger Kia Motors in the 1997-98 IMF crisis. Not only did he manage to take over Kia Motors, but also develop it into an international brand that in 2010, Hyundai Kia Motors became the top five automotive companies in the world. Chung always emphasized the importance of high quality in his business to the extent of being known for his quality business management. The South Korean chief is well known for spearheading Hyundai Motors' growth with new plants in key regions such as in the United States, Europe, China, India, Brazil, and Russia. He is also known to have created a highly efficient vertically integrated business structure that produces everything from steel to vehicles. Selected as number 5 out of Korea's 50 richest people, Chung has also been hailed the 452nd richest billionaire in 2019 on the Forbes list. His current net worth is $3.9 billion. The Automotive Hall of Fame's 2020 inductees include Chung mong gu Thomas Gallagher, former CEO of Genuine Parts Company, Jay Leno, Automotive Heritage Leadership through his Jay Leno's Garage series on CNBC, and Helen Rother, one of the first women in automotive interior design for General Motors, Nash Motors, and others.